<clears throat> so, basically what we did here is we used this as an increment. Uh, in the real world where this similar thing might be used is maybe we're stacking something and we want to stack to a certain height. So in this instance with the example of five, maybe we want to stack something five parts high and then we want to go on to the next thing. So you can do like this uh, and, 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 then, and then have a jump that then uh, takes you somewhere else. So. Also, another thing to keep in mind is where this is located at will change in the program. We'll change the program completely, right? So to give an example, if I go let's copy, if I go copy, copy, move cursor to selected range, copy. The reason it should have gave me a cut, it didn't give me a cut. By the way, I just kind of went through those things. Uh, you don't really have to worry about that unless it's a position. So I'll go ahead, uh, continuing where we left off, we just added this position or this uh, if statement down here. And I'm also removing this if statement right here. Right, this is a pretty simple uh, thing to look at and be able to tell what's gonna happen. So from here, can you kind of tell what the code will do? Get down to line 14 and it's gonna jump from line 14 up to, up to line three and it's gonna continue to do that infinitely. This number, the, the register value will continue to add up because it's inside the loop. However, you'll never get down to line 16 where you'll execute the if statement. So like to, to, to go into another example of of something very similar to that. So we say copy. Just copy that one thing. And then we'll come back up here to the top and say paste logic. So now, honestly, since it was never going to run this one anyway, it don't matter if you delete it or not. However, it's terrible like programming practice to not delete it. So you always want to like delete stuff that you're not going to use or you're done using or anything that's like dead logic. So now that I changed this if statement, so the if statement's now on line four, we had it like on line like 14 or something at one point. So now that it's on line four, in a lot of times, this would be the more appropriate way to go about this. Meaning you would add the value at the end and then you would make the decision at the beginning. So a lot, a, lot of, a lot of times it's better to make your decision to do something prior to starting whatever the thing is you're gonna do.